Lobby Tools, Florida's legislative intelligence company. Subscribe today to Florida's leading policy, budget, and campaign tracking service. Request a free trial today at LobbyTools.com. The back roads of Liberty and Calhoun counties in Florida's panhandle look like a bomb has gone off. Calhoun County lost 90% of its timber. Uh, to put it in perspective, we, we estimate that there's roughly an equivalent of two and a half million truckloads of timber laying on the ground. It could be as much as a 20 year supply of, uh, of wood laying there. The trees have been down 60 plus days and the clock is running on how long they can be salvaged. We'll only be able to use the timber for a certain amount of time and then it'll be pulp wood at that point. You know, somewhere around six to nine months before the bugs move in. These downed trees do represent a human tragedy. Timber is one of the biggest industries around in this part of rural North Florida. Carla Peacock is the property appraiser in Calhoun County. Some of the, the timber workers are already leaving the area because they they have to have work and there there are no you know jobs. I know one family had 600 acres of timber they had was planning on for their retirement and it's all gone. Losses in Florida timber alone total more than 1.3 billion dollars. None of it is insured. We're working with Congress to get them some help. If they don't get that land cleaned up and replanted then you've really got a long-term economic crisis in these rural counties. And while timber prices are down now, once the glut is gone, prices are going to go up, and that'll raise the price of building new homes. Reporting from Calhoun County, I'm Mike Vasilinda.